G'day everybody, it's Nick Davis from uh, All World Tube on behalf of the Legoville part of the channel. Uh, we're going to have a quick look at uh, Expert Creator Set 10270, the Bookshop, 2504 pieces. We're going to have a quick look at it after the jump. Hey everybody and welcome back after the jump. We are going to be taking a quick look at, uh, well, this uh, expert creator set. We picked it up on Saturday from the Lego store down here locally in Maryland, down in Annapolis in the Westfield Mall. And spent most of the weekend building this 2004 piece, piece set. It's soon to be placed in the city, but before I place in the city, I thought I'd do a quick look at it so you can quickly see this set for yourself. All I can say is it's a nice little build. Um, when I built the uh, townhouse and pet store, it was a little bit more complicated to build than this was. So this, it was for me, a nice, easy, easy little build to do. Basically, you're just building boxes with some architectural points on it. So I'm going to give you a quick 360 here. Yeah, I don't have a turntable or like a white room, but hey, you know, old tech, old tech. I'm just going to pull them apart and then we're going to quickly break down the modules so you can have a quick look inside of the building. One of my favourite components of this is the birch tree build here. Now that was pretty good fun. Um, old technique parts, but it kind of worked. So hey, nothing to complain about that. Only real complaint is I wish it wasn't basically uh, autumn colours because my city is a temperate environment and I don't have enough leaves to finish the thing up. That being said, we're going to quick look at birch books. And then we're going to have a quick look at the townhouse attached to it. So we're going to pull it apart. For speed, I haven't connected it. And we're going to basically going to drill down from the top. So I'm hoping my light, light works here. First things first. The boy minifig and the, uh, the woman minifig were basically part of the extra set itself. When we go through the modules, as you know, I sometimes basically put some minifigs from my collection in there. And in this case, it's no different. So, love the hair on this one. Fantastic. And he's all dressed up for fall, but it kind of works. And I've got a couple of buddies we can put in there too with him. A quick look at the tree. I'm going to just break this down in pieces later for my brick link. We'll probably get a few more of these birches in the city because they look really nice. So I'm going to break down from the top. This is a module, as you know. So everything comes off, off quite, quite nicely. Leads up to the top, so I'm going to see if I can get the top off here. I don't know if I can, though. But... This is the main lounge area. Grandfather clock is pretty cool. Nice little steps leading up to the top. That's where the bed is. Um, we just come around. Love this recliner. And nice little desk lamp for reading. Let's see if I can just push off the top here. Hang on. Put it down for a second. We do have some minifigs while I do this. There we go. Okay. And we're back. This is the inside of the roof section. Um, as I'm doing this all one-handed, it's a little difficult to get everything right. But this breaks off the back here. There's the bed. And it's pet lizard. There we go, it's better for the tank there. Let's get some more light in here. Oh! All professional lighting systems. I haven't got you at all. I don't know if you can see the puppy, but there's a lizard in there as well. Gonna put the roof back on for modular. This one really pops together quite well. Obviously in the back here there's a nice little balcony. And we're gonna take this bit off here. Oh, there we go. We're gonna look down into the bookshop. Second floor here, some more book builds. There we go, that comes off nicely there. Bookshop owner is there. He one of my minifigs there and I put in one of my other minifigs just there. A little sparse inside, I thought there'd be more books in here than it is, but it's a really nice little build. As I say, this is old boxes, worked really well. And I particularly like, if you can see it, if you can see it, moldy brick behind the window there. Let's quickly put this back together again, and then we're going to quick look at the second part, part of this modular. Oh, the grippy, grippy clutch clutch is very clutchy today. And again, I put it together without putting this part back in. There we go. There. Being very clutchy. Put the roof back on. Oh, 
this would be so much easier if I had a tripod. Pop that back there, and we'll do a quick look at the town hall. Here it is. Completed this this afternoon, about four or five hours, very leisurely build. You've been on my, following my, le my Facebook page, Legoville, uh, my Legoville Facebook page at facebook.com slash Legoville Town. Uh, you'll be seeing pictures of some of these builds during the day going on. This one I pretty much kept to myself because, you know, you get Lego kits to build and that's relaxing to do that way. The chair is one of my own additions there. Slightly modding it and we added a little bit more to the garden back there too. Nice little little town home. Again, it's just all, all a box. So let's get the back off here. Oh, here we go. This the interior of this townhouse is really cool. Really love the bed here. Nice little dresser. Pictures on the wall. Lamp looks really nice. It comes apart. A lot of using in birch box does. Is the interior of the townhouse. Nice little fire teapot there. Steps going up there. Nice interior. Really nicely done. Nice little bay window. And quick look at the minifigs. All three minifigs here are from the actual crater set. There. Here we go. Here we go. One, two, and three. This guy here. Kind of reminds me what I probably would look like when I get a little bit older. A lot of grey there, nice full beard and hair though, so I'm very happy for myself. And we can take off the last part here, hope we can get this right. Oh. The clutch power on these bricks is more than normal, so I can probably carry this thing around just by the roof, but I'm not going to because, you know, things may happen. This is the basement area. I can turn this around so you can see what's going on inside the basement. Ladder's detachable. Mouse trap, shears in the wall, blank sack, nice little green bay, door that goes out here. Old school door, I've not seen one of those for <laughs> you don't want to know a very, very long time. So there we go. Put this back together now. So do this all one handed. The architecture on the front, and I'll point this out in a second so you can see it. This was a fairly simple build, nice little architecture elements. The weakest part is the, is the bay windows, but I found with bay builds that have always been the weakest part of the Lego build. They're fairly strong, but don't put any real pressure on it, and they will just break through and they end up rebuilding it. <laughs> Did that a couple of times, I can tell you. But that's a nice little architectural piece there. You get the uh, the roof, front of, front, front of this roof on. This is all hinge joint stuff. So basically you put it on, put it on three or four flats with basically uh, tiles put on top and it's hinged at the top there. So that'll work quite, out quite well. It's a very nice little townhouse. Really, I don't understand why they don't sell these things like a singular item. That'd be really nice, right? You know, get two or three different type of time home kits, half the price of a normal modular. Get more of these said, but I really, really dig this bed. So let's put this all back together. So it all pops together like so. Clutch power is pretty high in this one, um, which surprised me. But you know, there we go. We'll push these together, but not click these together because I've got to get these downstairs in Legoville itself. And there we have that is my quick mini review and look at uh, Lego Expert Creator Kit 10270. It's the Creator Bookshop, latest release from the modular range. 2,504 pieces, a lot of fun build, very easy build, probably one of the easier creator sets I've actually built, mainly because it's, you are just building boxes, which is really nice and simple. Uh, I found the uh, creator set for the town, the townhouse and pet shop much more complicated to build than this was, even the diner was, but you know, it's nice and simple, it's two separate builds, you can break it down, very easy, you're not building one big massive thing. And there we go. So that was basically a quick look at the uh, creator, creator Bookshop, or Birch Books. Um, this is Nick Davis on Pot Art World 2, part of Legoville. Uh, signing off, saying please like and share this video with your friends. And we will see you again very, very soon when this gets placed in the city. And you can see the changes this will make to, Le to Legoville itself. So I'll talk to you guys later. You'll take care now. This is Nick Davis, signing off. You'll get your break on now. Bye.